Hello everyone, today I'll be showing you guys the trunk group feature that has just been added to Magnus Bling. So if you update your system, you're going to get it. And also if you make a new install, you're also going to get it. In the case you update it, do not worry. The system is going to update all your data to the new system and nothing will be lost. So in this server right here, as you guys can see, I have plans and everything set up here. I have a tariff for Brazil and it points to a trunk group here. Um, if we go over to the trunks here, I have five trunks here and also they're all, they all point to an invalid host. So they're all going to fail and get sent to the next one to try to complete the call right here in the trunk group. I have all of them in a order here. Um, I can remove them. I can add them back in a specific order. So that's up to you. So let's execute a test. Um, lift the trunk group setup like that. Type order in a specific order here. Let's save uh, and open the logs here. I'm going to send a call. And as you guys can see here in the logs, the call arrives, they, it gets sent to the first run, second one, third one, fourth one, and then fifth one, and then fails because it could, couldn't complete. So if we also set it to type here to random, we can also check that. It's going to be in random order. Right here. So you guys can see here, trunk four, trunk three, uh, it was random. You can, as I said before, you can set it up in any order you want. And the tariffs for the the trunks are going to be used as well. So you don't need to worry about tariffation. This is only to prevent some loops in the trunks. And it's a way better feature now than it was before with only the trunk backups. So if you guys have any questions, please comment on the video, ask in the Telegram group. And if you guys want, you can get commercial support to either update your system or training or basically anything related to Magnus billing with us at magnusolution.com. Um, thanks for watching. That's it.